So in this short video, we're going to look at what I would typically carry for a day on grade one scrambling ground. We're here in the summer, so I'm looking at what I would carry in summer conditions. I want to keep my pack nice and light if I can. It's going to make my day more enjoyable. So this is what I typically carry. My woolly hat, or maybe a sun hat on a day like today. Some insulation clothing to keep me warm and enough so that if I need to sit still for a couple of hours, I can do. I've got my mobile phone in case of emergencies, so that lives switched off in my bag, but if I need it, it's there and it's fully charged. I've got my scrambling guidebook, which is going to tell me where my routes are and give me a description, a blow-by-blow -blow sort of description of the, the routes that I want to go and do. And then to complement that, I've got my map of the area and my compass to help me with my navigation. In case I have a problem, uh, I've got a little group shelter so I can get in out of any foul weather and wait for help to arrive or perhaps just something to sit and have my lunch in on a day where the weather's not quite as nice as it is today. On a similar vein, my first aid kit, something I'm hoping I'm not going to need but uh, something that lives permanently in the bottom of my rucksack. My lunch, essential, and then my water for the day. So I typically carry a litre of water with me uh, more on a, on a really hot day. And then my waterproof jacket and my waterproof trousers. So not only there to keep the rain off, but also as an extra insulating layer and to keep the wind off if it gets cold up high. So this is what I typically carry on a grade one scrambling route here in Snowdonia in the summer.